Where are you at? Sounds like you're over that side. Oh, nope, you're over there. Oh! Hey guys, welcome back to Bernimbar Overture. Oh. Ah, my memory is like something with a great many small holes. We shall be needing to perform some minor demolition work so that we might one day meet again. For this task, we shall require the use of a large, earth-eating metal monster. And that monster is thirsty for juice from the place where things are kept. All right. By the way, oh. you can call me Red. It's not my name, you understand, but, but I am sure you will agree. It's a name rather similar to a cardigan. Fetching when worn correctly. Okay, well, you're not a cardigan, so I don't know why we're calling you that. Alright, so welcome back to Number number Overture. It's been a little bit for me. I'm not quite sure what I should be doing right now, and I kind of forgot how to play. I'd only play for a small period of time because I will be going to school soon. Or back to school, I guess I should say. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> oh, snap! Oh, he's not dead. I thought that would have sure killed him. Can't get me up here, man. Can't get me up here. I'm invincible. Wasn't there two of them earlier? I think there was two of them earlier. I'm not really sure, though. Get out of here. I want to try to hit that. Make it explode. Come on. Come on. Oh, come on, you stupid dog. Stupid dog. Ah. Ah. Die. Die. Ah. It's really hard to hit. Ah. Because it's like a... Gotta move the mouse like you're actually swinging it kind of thing. So it's hard to, like, look around and also use it to hit. Oh, I can't even hit him from up here. Gotta use the broom. Got him. With the broom. Alright, here. Trick shot. Ah! Ah! No! Death is the final unknown. I was trying to do, like, a blow it up and... Never mind. Where's this freaking thing at? Come here, doggy. Come here, dog. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do, guys. Boom! Did I get him? Woo! Oh, snap! Ah! Come on, Alex. Come on. Gotta get this down. Earth-eating metal monster. And that monster is thirsty for juice from the place where things are kept. By the way, you can call me Red. It's not my name, you understand, but, but I am sure you will agree. Is he dead? Is he finally dead? He's dead. Nice. Alright, now I have to heal myself, because I am very much going to die. Alright, so I need more painkillers, so that's on my list. That's on my grocery list of things to get here. Let's start exploring this area. What? It's... Oh, oh I heard another one. Alright, I don't see him just yet. Where is he? Oh, there he is. He sees me! Ah! Uh, come on. Come here. Stupid dog. Stupid dog. This is what we're going to do. We're just going to keep... Keep jumping from thing to thing. Ah! 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 No! Come here. I'll stab you with my broom. My broom of justice. Hua! Hua! All right. It's not. It's not working. Ah! 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 Stay away! Stay away! I'll, I'll sweep you to death! Oh! 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 I didn't think he could get up there. Okay then. This is really difficult. So let's try this way and hopefully there's nothing that wants to kill me this way. There's a lot of these here. I wonder if I need them for something. Ah! No! 
not again. Never ending. Never ending pursuit by these freaking dogs. Is he still behind me? I don't see him anymore. I must have outran him, which is weird because they run faster than me. Okay, I think I'm good. Hello? Ooh, that's bright. Oh, that's really bright. But we got a saw. That's nice. What's this say? A Zeno report. Uh, chief attending Zeno officer. Leader, unlike the other findings, 66B appears to be of manufactured rather than natural origin and so warrants additional interest in need I say security. The bulk of substance 63 was discovered only six yards from where artifact 66B was buried and appears at least in part to consist of a solidified form of 63. With a number of operable appendages, the artifact emits a low level of light from a seemingly inexhaustible energy supply, suggesting that its origin is indeed as was suspected. Of course, the ramifications of this fact are clear, and appropriate measures are already being taken. Progress and becoming enlightened as to the purpose of the device, if needed, if indeed it served a purpose in the traditional, blah, 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 blah. All right, you guys can read that. Let's go ahead and read that. Pause right now. Pause right now. All right, I'm not reading that. I'm I'm sorry. I've got a timer. I've got time to keep, and uh, I feel like it's just nonsense. I don't know if it's really super important right to now to the story. I'm gonna take this with me, so I can throw it right at that dog as soon as he sees me. These don't explode on impact like I wish they would. Like I wish I could just throw them like a grenade and it would explode, but it doesn't work like that. Uh, I need to hit it first, and then it lights up, and then it kills them. Okay. Let's go this way again. I think I already went down this way in one of my tries. Hello? Hello? No, this is all new to me. Hello? Is this... Where? Where's that coming from? Oh, well, this is storage, so... Damn, I can't store up and try to end note just in case. Those holes in my mind are increasingly gaping. You cannot breach the inner sanctum of the place of storing. The entryway is blocked. So what if the squashy material between my ears is squashier than most? I may not be perfect like a hanging picture, but my words are wise and backed up by time. A pox! A pox on both your brain cells! Try as I may, you must think that I deceive you with my admittingly cunning ways. As far as my eye has seen, our rocky grave extends, and yet you cast away my hope like you would a puppy, freshly rolled in its own feces. I hope that your warped sense of morality is a better company than I, because now it is all you have left. All right, dude, you have a uh, you have a great day, you freaking weirdo. Um, I'm sorry. Okay. Sometimes my emotions are like a disobedient. Uncontrollable and often rolling in shit. <laughs> Better safe than sorry, they say. But I think we are both sorrier than we are safe. The uh? tunnel lies between a nearby watery cave and the place where things are kept. Take the second right from the closed door, and you will find what you seek. Ah! 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 Come on, man. Did I at least get a save point at some point? Did it save? Okay, cool. It saved me right here. I don't have to do that crap again. But he's going to start talking again, and I'm going to have to ignore him. I can just crouch. All right, so second right from the closed door. That's the first right. And this is the second right. Cool, so every time I kill one of those dogs, like, the whole screen seems to shake. I don't know if that's... Oh. Okay. Well, it's just glitching a little bit. There we go. This is really creepy. What is that? What is that? What's that noise? I can't see anything. Oh. Pretty high though. 
Yeah, that's why there was a ladder here. Uh, the test substance continues to defy identification. Both chemical and xeno investigations failed to produce meaningful results. Testing continues. Bromine tests normal pH 5. Acetamide tests negative. Ammonia negative. Hydrochloric acid solution negative. Standard hallucinogenic mild intox intoxicant. Tests have been due to most tests after suffering mass internal hemorrhaging within one to two hours. Positive, negative, metal patients incomplete. Human hallucinogenics incomplete. Testing of the gaseous fog has been considerably more successful. It appears to be a harmless blend of sulfur, chlorine, and aromatic amine, which gives it the floating visual effect. Please note that harmless here is used in the xeno chemic sense. It is harmless in so far as we have identified it, and so it can take the necessary safety measures and directly ingest it, it would naturally be lethal. Work continues on the issue of transporting the substance so far. Removing it from its dormant location causes its base state to radically change, producing mass heat to the detriment of three workers, one of whom is no longer operational due to his injuries. Following heat dissipation, the substance appears to turn dead, unreactive to every test we have the equipment to run. The prevailing theory is that somehow the disruption of the material causes it to enter hugely accelerated chemical decay. We estimate its half to be approximately 0.4 seconds. Wow, okay. So that's a fast one. It's a big flat plane of rock, probably used for loading. It almost looks like some kind of altar. Okay. I wish I could see stuff. What's that? Looks like some kind of excavation, although not like any uh, money of money operation I've seen. I don't know where that mist is coming from, but I don't fancy getting closer to it to find out. That's what they were just talking about in the note. Isn't, mm, lights are much newer. Alright. What am I supposed to... Oh, right. One of those things. I forgot about that thing. <clears throat> the man still clutching, still looking for what? Before him lies metal, jutting outward from the earth. A hatch, a portal, a hole, a door. Unfamiliar text. Who are these figures huddled around? What secrets are hidden behind the faces of men? That's a great question. I felt something that time. That I didn't feel before, but I'm sure it's always been there. It's as if a small part of me is still trapped inside the artifact. Interesting. There's a draft coming from that dank, dank looking hole up there. All the same, it's hardly inviting. In fact, it's the complete opposite. So what is I supposed to come in here and get? Can I read my journal? It's nine. Notes. Information findings. No, no, no. I don't want notes. I want to-do list. Beyond the fence to the right, there should be a hole perhaps nice to reach further into the mine. Found what I think is the storeroom, but it's blocked from the other side. I need another way in. Is this the other way in? But how am I supposed to get all the way up there? This ladder is broken. I mean, I have dynamite. But I doubt that's going to help. I just hear skittering. Not quite sure what to do. Well, I'm going back up to the other room because there doesn't seem to be anything in here for me. Let's just explore a little bit more, I suppose. Explore some more. Nope, empty. What's this? Oh, what is this? This is where I came from. Yeah, this is where I came from. I was like, oh, look, a new thing. Oh, wait. Is this where I came from? No, this looks new. Um, I'm gonna just gonna go and see what this is. Oh, no, this is where I came from. I just made a big old loop. Just made a big old poop. Whoa, 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 no. I like glided across the platform. Um. We can put it supported with a piece of wood on the other side. Need some way to shift it. What do I have? I have a saw, so I'll use the saw on it after I take care of this wiener. All right, runtime, runtime. All right, cool. What are you doing? Just pushing boxes around with your little nose, your little doggy nose. Trust you for a second. 
battle me. Fight me. Zombie dog. Milex. Fight. Come come here. Fight me. You you pussy cat. Come here. Oh my god. Just come here. Come here. Seriously, dude. Nope. Stay in one spot. I just stay in one spot, wait till he comes right up, and then hit him. Down, boy. Down, boy. Just go away, and he's gonna come back. And then he's gonna go away. And then he's gonna come back, and then I hit him. Okay, he's dead. Alright, now let's use the saw. There we go, I got it. Alright, let's open it up, see what there is to see. That's not good. Oh cool, it's saved. Oh great, a dog. And I have no health. Flare. Calm radio. I can't eat this jerky. I end up throwing the jerky. Oh, right, I have that jerky. They will be attracted to the jerky. I forgot about that. It was a very important thing that I forgot about. Alright, so I have this. It will protect me from the, from the dogs. Nope, nothing in there. Hello? Hello? Anybody here? Oh, I heard somebody. Alright. Where you at? Sounds like you're over that side. Oh, nope. You're over there. Oh, fuck! Woo! Oh, God. That scared the sugar out of me. Ah! Ah! Woo! All right, here we are again. Here, take some meat. Take that meat. Take the meat. Ah, oh, they don't want the meat. They want my meat. You're not allowed to have it. You can't have it. You can't have my meat. Come here. Stay down. Stay down. The other one's still around here somewhere. Oh, no, no. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay. Nothing's up here. Okay, still got my my explosive thing. Hello? Oh, a note. Let's read it. Um, Anon... 9000, phase 338. Today marks the first play phase of excavation team B's new assignment, which I'll be overseeing. Equipment has arrived. Blah, 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 blah. While work has been slow up until now, the new year is sure to bring with great prosperity for, by our, or for our team. Perhaps we shall enjoy some of the luck that the other teams seem to already be harvesting. Further routine work reports will be filled, filed in a secondary log. I cannot read for some reason right now. But you guys can read this all you like. There's there's obviously a very rich exposition here that you know, you guys can follow along in the story, but I'm not really interested in all that huge amount of exposition that I do not have time to read a whole book right now. This area must be access point to reach further into the mine. Oh, this is the thing that eats rocks that he was talking about. Let's see what happens this time around. From out the door rises something vast, something terrible. It strikes a man, no knocking him down, and those standing by him wither into the darkness, screaming beggings. Still, father looks on. Is he bringing this? Father, what have you done? What have you done, Father? Suppose I can't trust these things a bit more. I'm not dead yet, so they have purpose. What could it be? I don't know, man. 
You seem kind of weird. I hate it when my voice cracks like that. It's the most annoying thing. There's no power in the control panel. Of course there's not. Well, I gotta plug it in. Good chick. And then... Good chick. And then... Good chick. Or power's on when nothing else is on the cards. I've jotted down a note just in case. What's my note? You mean to jot down to do us? Mining machine needs ignition key. It needs a key. I'm sure it's in another room somewhere. Well, that's quite a machine. It doesn't come any more industrial size than that. Those teeth at the front are pretty sharp. The whole thing just looks mean. That front. Yeah. This thing is huge. Alright. Oh, there's stuff up there. Oh, there's a couple things up there. Flare and a dynamite. Give me it! Give me it! the most annoying thing ever. Alright, so I gotta find the ignition key. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Alright. Okay. okay. He's running away, so that means I'm gonna run away a little bit. What happens if I just open up one of these? And then just close it. <laughs> Will he even... Does he even know where I am? I don't think he's following me anymore. Okay. Hello? I, I want to open the door. There we go. I thought I was trapped. That would have sucked. That would have sucked so bad. No? Nope. Nothing in there either. I'm going to bring this just in case. It's a good, like, one hit to get away from him. Uh, of course. Uh, of course he did. Ah! Get away! Oh! Did he not see me? Did he just... Did he really just, like... Wow. What a dummy. Okay, so if he wants to go ahead and be a dummy, that's fine with me. Alright, so I feel like I'm going in circles here. And I still need that ignition key. I don't really know how to read this map. It doesn't really make it easy. But I see that I'm right there. And that this goes to the other section. And that's that big section that I was wandering around in for a little bit. And that looks like the start of it down there. Oh no, does he see me? Oh, well, now he does. But you won't get me. So I can just sit in here and just hold it closed. And I'm just good. I'm just safe. Wait, I want to see. Oh, maybe I'm not. Whoa! No, no, no. Ooh, this is kind of creepy. Hello! <laughs> Hello! Hello! <laughs> Hello! Oh my god, that's pretty funny. And he's not actually hurting me. Like, this doesn't hurt me. Alright, I kind of want to get out now. I'm feeling very claustrophobic. He won't let me get out. He won't let me get out! And he's knocking me back! There. I don't think I have to worry about any more dogs around here. So I think I'm pretty good on the dog situation. I don't know where else to really go. Auxiliary shaft. Have I been there yet? I'm not sure. 
Yes, this is the beginning. Zillow shaft is down that way. So, is there a map somewhere around here that I can just take a gander at? Tool shed, I've been there. I've been to the tool shed. I've been to... The only thing left is the excavation site, but there's, like, nothing there. Hmm. There's nothing I could do with the excavation site, I don't think. Unless there's, like, a box I can pull or something. I don't know. Alright, so what I'm going to try to do is see if I can... Oh, I can't lift these up. See if I can get these boxes up on top there. See if that helps my cause a little bit. Because there's like a ramp right here to like do it. So perhaps that's the point. Well, I'm a little bit off from, from that. Alright, so, I'm thinking, it's just a thought, but by what my character just said about these hooks here, that I can possibly, possibly hook it onto the thing, maybe... I got it! Okay. I did it! But bam! I did it. I did it. Well, I kind of fell before I got up there, but I did it. I mean, woo! Alright, now I've got no choice but to move on. Whatever's made this tunnel, it's home. Clearly, it uns did not. It unstable as well. Never mind. I don't know what they said. But that's where I'm going to end the episode. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Ciao, ciao.